So another Democratic candidate has dropped out of the 2020 presidential race. California Senator Kamala Harris informed her supporters that her campaign is over. Danya Backus has some reaction from Los Angeles. Senator Kamala Harris launched her presidential campaign in January and quickly emerged as a potential frontrunner. I stand before you today clear-eyed about the fight ahead and what has to be done. But the California Democrat informed supporters on Tuesday she has run out of money. It is with deep regret, but also with deep gratitude, that I am suspending our campaign today. Harris's husband followed the news with this affectionate tweet saying, I've got you as always. And her former rivals paid their respects. She is an incredibly uh, strong public servant and has done great work already for our country in the U.S. Senate. Um, and I know she is going to do even more. I've mixed emotions about it because she is really a solid, solid person. And uh, we're loaded with talent. Harris is the first African-American senator in California history, and her campaign gathered some major endorsements. But after raising $12 million in the first three months, her fundraising stayed flat. She dropped to single digits in the polls, and critics said she lacked a clear message. A series of negative articles chronicled upheaval in her campaign staff, drawing an objection from her former rival, Julian Castro. Grossly unfair and unfortunate. I'm glad that she's going to keep fighting in the United States Senate. In the past two days, Montana Governor Steve Bullock and Pennsylvania's Joe Sestak also ended their campaigns. With Senator Harris officially out, 15 candidates remain in the race for the Democratic nomination. Donya Backus, CBS News, Los Angeles.